All right. So we're going to talk about how to make a facet. I'm just recapping for the recording. Um, that allows us to split up our contributors field, i.e. the linked agent field, um, into different things depending on what relation it has. So this is a solar field. So the first thing we need to do is go into the search API configuration, hit this, the solar index, that's the second one, and then head over to the processors tab. Then from here, if we scroll down, uh, we should see a new, actually one thing that I should have mentioned is that you need to update um, to the latest controlled access terms, which is version 2.4. If you don't have version 2.4 of controlled access terms, you probably will not have this option available. Um, so it's called typed relation filtered by type. And then you can go down to save and click save. Now that does nothing yet, but it's going to make some more fields available when you go into the fields tab and click on add fields. So we have to scroll down from past the general section to the content section. And then we're going to scroll down to our field contributors. And we find here it is, this new, this new thing that was just added. So it's got a really long name, but it is contributors filtered by type on island or object. So I'll click add. And here is where we get to say which relations are included in this filter. Um, so maybe I want just a creator's authors kind of thing. Um, so I might, if I don't click, if I don't, like control click or shift click. I'm only clicking one at a time. Um, but you can also shift click to collect the range and control click to select uh, another one as well. And okay, right. Creator. Be under R. And I'll go up and get author. So control click. Um, anyone else want to suggest something that goes in here? I can put photographer. I think we've got some photographs in here that are cataloged like that. Okay, so I'll click save and done. And now if I scroll down, oh, and I need to stretch out my window because <laughs> something is really long in here. So it's not showing us, there we go. So contributors filtered by type, island or object. I can give that a nicer human readable name and just put author. I'll put it in all caps because that's my caps lock key was on, but it'll also help us identify that when we need to. Um, I'm gonna leave the machine name. It seems it's fine. Um, and then all the way at the bottom, save changes. Okay, so everything's scheduled for re-indexing. Nothing's in the in the um, in the is going to show up yet until we index it. So now we have to index. Okay, now I'm going to resize my screen again so that I can see everything. And okay, so we've got 97 items on this server. I I just installed the demo content. Um, and the next step is going to be to make a facet. So that is under, actually, if you want, we could go to solar.islandora.dev. If you want to see what this looks like in the solar index, if you have access to your index, you can do this. Um, so just hit enter to try to get some stuff and then I'm going to scroll down for what that would be. And it was probably got linked agent in it. Linked agent name, full text, vid. Unless it's only got... Uh... Oh, here we go. Okay, so typed relation filter node, island or object fueling agent is the full solar field name. Um, but here we've got Ken Jones. Um, and I think this was a case of him being the photographer in the circulation desk. Um, Cause I didn't see it from any others. I'm, I'm really hoping I didn't only, I remember to control click photographer and didn't just click photographer, but uh, we will, we will find out soon enough. 
Um, all right, so back on our, our process. So we're getting a facet um, with the starter site. You've got a whole bunch of facet sources and you've got a whole bunch of stuff listed here. Um, what we've got is on top is the search within collection. So I've abbreviated that with SWC for search within collection. Um, that's like one view mode of this uh, solar search content view. And then the other view mode of solar search content is called page one, and it's got all the same facets. This is so that when you're doing the global search, all your facets are the same as if you're searching within a collection. And it's actually not entirely true. They're not the same. Uh, well, they're the same here, but we don't show the member of when you're searching within a collection because it's redundant. You're, you're within the collection, so they're all members of that collection. Um, okay, so we're going to add a facet for... To be complete, I would add it to both, but I'll just add it to the basic solar search. So search page, and then I'll choose my field. I'm scrolling down, it should be long. There we go, capital A author, yay. Um, and then the facet configuration that I usually like to do is hide inactive siblings. Um, oh, also up here, show the number of results, soft limit 10, show less, show more is fine. And then, the, the rest of the defaults are usually pretty good. So like hide it when the facet source view isn't rendered, um, et cetera, okay, save. So the final thing to do is take a block um, under the sidebar, I'm gonna place a block, I'm gonna find author, my facets, and then I'll say, so I'll put this on the main solar collection view. And so view inclusion kind of says include this when this view is visible. So solar search content is the one that I want. That's how the rest are, are uh, set up to. So I'll just throw this at the top so we can see it. And then save blocks, back to site. We're on our search content view and there's our authors. Yes, it worked. And we probably didn't control click because Lucy Montgomery is not a photographer in any case that I remember. Um, so you can do that as many times as you want with whatever different collections of relators that you want. And it it really works best as a as a facet type thing. That was really where I where I went with it. Um, I think it could also work in a view as a filter, but um, yeah, I'm not sure if, if that field will show up as a field in views. Anyway, um, are there any questions? I have one question. Um, have you tried to select all relators? for or all relators except author and creator to create kind of a contributor, a generic contributor facet? And if if you have, um, have you seen any issues with performance associated with trying that? I don't know. I mean, I could try it here, but we only have a hundred items, so it wouldn't really give you an example of performance um, okay. because it will like the performance hit will happen when you're indexing your content into solar. If there's a if there's a hit, um, and so once if you're creating once you're done creating context and your stuff is ready to go, um, pulling data out of Solar is extremely fast. So I don't think that that would be a problem at all. Okay, thanks. No problem. And can you say the plug again? Because I don't think uh, the recording caught that. What plug? Or, or uh, uh, the, the, you said it was the type relation filtered solar plugin to, to be able to do this? Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait. I don't recall if I haven't done this before, but okay. Uh, so in case we didn't catch this the first time, uh, under processors, the thing that we're going to use is down here, typed relation filtered by type. 
So that's our that's the plugin. You want it selected so that you can have that those fields enabled. Was that the was that where I, where you're missing? Yes, I think so. Okay, thank you. All right, anything else? If not, I will end the recording and then stop sharing if I can.